morning guys hope you guys are all doing well uh, welcome to my channel today i'm gonna show you guys a quarantine day in a life with me all the schools are closed everything all the shops are closed but right now i'm heading off to a local business meetup meeting which i have never been there before and i just found that on google and I was just trying to surround myself with like-minded people, trying to make connections, surrounding myself with people whom I aspire to be. And I believe that is important for everyone. So especially if there is no virus outbreak, I would highly suggest you to find meetups in anything that you want to grow. It could be business, it could be fitness. There are so many things just important that you're surrounding yourself with people who are even better than them. Even though you may not be able to find like-minded, growth-oriented individuals like you, physically, you may be able to find that digitally. And one of the ways that I found so helpful is through Facebook groups. And I also made one for our group, which is for fitness, productivity, and entrepreneurship as a bonus. So if you're into it, join it in the description box below. Uh, anyways, I woke up like 20 minutes ago, so I'm running kind of late. And so I'm just going to head over there and hopefully the bakery that I am going to is also open. This is actually really scary guys. I'm pushing out of my comfort zone. What if I meet like 30 year old, 40 year old successful business people and I'm just someone who's barely getting started and who is around like a college age student and just trying to meet people. All those what ifs come into you, but we gotta fight that. I just arrived. Okay, so it turned out there was no one. I just kind of look like a fool again because I went there last week too and there was no one. I actually registered for this, but I'm surprised that there is no one, even like a few people. But anyways, I think, yeah, quarantine is really hitting hard. But yeah, I'm just gonna put it out there too because I'm documenting my failures, everything that went wrong that is not as expected so that perhaps later on it could inspire you guys so now let's just get back to my regular routine so i got back home and i want to talk about some things that are super important during this time of doubt and fear and irrationality spreading among people it's so easy for people to look at things that we don't have and not things that we have every morning i find that writing down a grateful journal of the things that you have it really spreads through, throughout your day and not just you who feels great but also expressed to other people in terms of love compassion kindness happiness for example one of them is me i am just so grateful that i get to live another day where i can breathe as a fully functional human being because i know some people are stuck in hospital and they don't even know whether they have a chance to live in another day well we all of us don't but at least i'm grateful that today a brand new day is given to me i'm so grateful that there is food on my plate even though it may be just the oatmeal because every other meal that is on the shelves are taken by other people it is still so much better than having no food and i'm just so grateful that at least i have a phone that i can edit i know the library may be closed in the near future probably because you know the quarantine the school is really taking this seriously so i might not even have a computer to edit my videos with but i still have a phone and i am just so grateful that at least there is something that i can record my videos with and share that with you all and some other things that i'm grateful for is like how there is so much time for me now like i don't have to go back and forth to classes and instead like i can also work on my business further enhance my knowledge and everything like exercise science spreading out with you all working on my business plans learning about investing all of you like i want you to guys to take advantage of the time where you are stuck at your house and because of 
the situation where you might not be able to go to work, maybe this would open up new opportunities and you just have to be creative. You, like, you just have to bring yourself to another level and it is those obstacles that actually make us better grow and adapt to the changing scenario and not just take things for granted. So now I am at the library. I edited for three straight hours, no break. I somehow felt lost in that in a good way and that is like I felt like I was in a state of flow and that is so great. Time just flew by so fast and I was actually enjoying the little tiny details in like Adobe After Effects. And I also realized one thing that sometimes I have lots of footage filmed but the reason why I don't upload it is because I haven't had time to edit it well. I also feel like that might be like an insecurity where I kind of worry about what other people might think if I upload a not well edited video like not you know very fancy edited video maybe that could be an insecurity but I recognize it and now I'll try to do a balance if I have time I will edit it well if I don't have time I will you know of course make sure that everything is well cut out but I'm not going to make it fancy or anything so that's what I realized and now I am going to eat lunch while I wait for the export and also work for my student exams paper which would be online for them. <laughs> looks so good what a lovely looking family dinner finally got back home my face looks shiny and smooth because my friend did a nighttime skincare routine for me and we're gonna see if the routine works for like a week and if it does i'm going to be posting here and sharing that with you all news for today i actually got a brand new macbook Whew. you remember when i was talking about this morning about how i am like grateful j even just by having a phone i know i totally was not expecting that my school just handed out new macbook because like i requested it the other day as a faculty because i'm stu teaching undergraduate students and now i received this really brand new laptop and yeah like i just felt like my gratefulness in this morning just got multiplied so that was you seeing an event something like that happening real life it might give me for like the whole semester to use it so that is cool i can will be able to edit videos on that as well also i have been working on a free at home workout guide and here's a peek of 
But so yeah, so the next few days I'm trying to be super productive, uh, getting lots of school stuff done while also getting this at home workout out. And if I have it, I will link it down in the description box below. If not, then sure, at some point in the future, I will definitely have it in the channel and I'll let you guys know when it's out so far. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you really enjoyed this video spending a day with me and also get some motivation to do something productive, get out, stay active, live happy, even during those dark times. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, leave some nice comments, and I will see you on my next video.